we present depth-aware lensless imaging using programmable masks. While lensless imagers find it challenging to reconstruct scenes with depth variations, our paper showed that a programmable mask not only enables robust depth estimation, but also provides a fast reconstruction algorithm. Let's understand why it's challenging to reconstruct depth-varying scenes from lensless imagers. For an amplitude mask lensless camera, the measurement of a point light source are shadows of the amplitude mask. When the points are on the same depth, the point spread function are translated copies of each other, and simple deconvolution is often sufficient to reconstruct the scene. When points move to different depths, however, the point spread function becomes depth dependent. As a consequence, reconstruction becomes difficult as we need to solve for both the location and the brightness of point sources. Consider a scene of two planes, for example. The left plane is at 3 cm, and the right plane is at 12 cm from the mask. Here is a scene. There are two broad approaches for reconstructing depths varying scenes. The first one models the scene with a texture map and a depth map. The number of unknowns is approximately twice that of measurements, but it is a highly nonlinear inverse problem. The second approach is to model the scene as a volumetric texture or intensity function. For example, this scene would decompose into textures onto multiple depth planes. One, two, three, Four. There needs to be enough number of depth planes in the volume to correctly model surface with continuous depth variation. As a result, the number of unknown becomes much larger than the number of obtained measurements, and this reconstruction becomes a severely underdetermined problem. To address the underdetermined reconstruction problem, we introduce programmable masks into lensless imagers to obtain more measurements. If we select the right masks, we have a well-conditioned system with a large number of unknowns and measurements. We show that translated masks can be used to bring a computational focusing operator into lensless imager so that we can reduce the size of reconstruction problem to a single depth plane and dramatically improve the reconstruction speed. Let me illustrate the focusing operator with a simple mask, a pinhole. The effect of focusing is very similar to that from a lens. As we translate the mask, we obtain multiple measurements. Note, seeing a different depth plane move with different disparity. Let's focus on the near plane. First, we calculate its disparity from the depth of the near plane. Then, we can shift the measurements accordingly and sum the measurements to focus on the near plane. We can do the same for the far plane. The same focusing operator can be applied to lensless measurements with more light-efficient masks. We will focus to emphasize measurements from the near plane that from the far plane. Note, in the focus near image, the red bolt in the near plane is more visible than in the focus far image. The focusing operator suppresses contribution from other depths. Given focused measurements, simple deconvolution with point spread function at focusing depth is enough to produce good reconstruction. This is reconstruction for near plane. And for far plane, we build a prototype to validate our method. Of a prototype programmable mask consists of an L cos sandwiched between a pair of cross polarizers. Here are results from captured data. A plane with flower pattern is placed at an angle in front of the imager. The focal stacks shown here are obtained by reconstructing for different depths. On the left, we show reconstruction results from 338 measurements with a static mask, and on the right, 
we show reconstruction from the same number of measurements obtained with translated masks. Note the high-frequency artifact caused by contribution from other depths are removed on the right. Here is another scene where a corner of a box is placed in front of the camera. Here is another scene of a small unicorn toy very close to the camera. Here is another scene of succulent plant. Note the white spots on the plant comes into and fades out of focus as the focus moves. Here is another scene with three toy figures standing at different depths. This work addresses the challenges of imaging depth varying scene with lensless imagers. We hope this will allow for more practical applications for lensless imagers. For more details, please refer to our paper. Thanks for watching.